Of course, nobody can say for sure that manipulation is going on behind the scenes, but what we are looking at from this data shows that things are looking very, very fishy, to say the least. We're going to be having a read of an article from Reddit. It was published six days ago, but don't worry, it is still very relevant. We can jump into this one and say it's a simple comparison from a smooth brain. AMC has an average daily volume of 65 million shares traded, and it has a market cap of 23.13 billion. Amazon has an average volume of 3 million shares traded, with a market cap of 1.76 trillion. We're seeing BlackBerry with an average volume of 10 million, but actually their market cap is 6.3 billion, and when we look down to Ford, 72 million, and they have a market cap of 80 billion. So one thing is clear over here. These are just a couple of examples, and if we have a quick look at them, we can see Ford has the highest volume per day out of any stock, and their market cap is 60 billion higher than what AMC's is. If we put this into perspective, we trade 14% of the float on a daily basis, meaning that the, the entire float will change hands every 7 days, and that is some high frequency trading. All of this is apparently happening whilst apes are owning 80% of the stock, and of course institutions are owning uh, about 27% at the time of writing this article, but of course it has changed since then. Overall though, we can see that was 80% back in June and this person has doubled their position since then. Now, I personally haven't doubled my position, but I certainly have been adding shares as and when I can afford it, and I'm sure the same is true for most of you guys. One thing that I do know for sure is that most people, emphasis on the most, are continuing to hold AMC. People are not getting bored. So why is the float apparently changing hands roughly every seven days? We're not having a turnover percent of 100 every, you know, every week, People are not leaving AMC that fast. Like I said, most people have been here now for the best part of a year. Nobody is leaving, and if anything, people are buying more and more. So I think you guys don't even need me to explain to you what this is saying. Things are looking good for us. I completely agree with this part here. You've done a great job. Don't let the FUD get you down, and let's try and lift each other up. But when you see data like this, it's very, very easy to lift yourself up because, you know, it just points out how things are going on behind the scenes. Now, like I said, we cannot say for sure that manipulation is happening, but we've seen so many shares traded. And of course, this volume figure is fluctuating from time to time, but institutions and retail own a significant portion of the stock and so do insiders. I personally think that the numbers don't add up and the statistics just don't make sense. It's just my interpretation of things, but I'm sure most of you guys see where I'm coming from. And I'm sure a lot of you guys do also agree. Now, like I said, I am not a financial advisor and this is only my opinion, but I just think something strange is going on with AMC. And I'm sure most of you have known this for a while, so it's not new news, but having a look at the actual data for it, it's very shocking. It's very, very shocking. And it does actually allow us to continue to feel very confident behind AMC because we're seeing all of this, you know, all of these numbers and we're seeing nothing but people buying and holding. But apparently we're having this high frequency trading where most people are apparently buying and then selling in a very short period of time. It just seems very off to me. Like you said, not financial advice, but I want to hear what you have to say in the comments. So thank you for watching through till the end. But let me tell you about our Discord. So on your screen, you will be seeing the N2S Finance Discord. Obviously, it is split into multiple sections. Basically, at the top, we have updates from me and all that kind of good stuff. If you scroll down a bit further, we have the main sections where we focus on cryptos, SPACs, and other hot stocks, including penny stocks, even stable growth stocks as well. And we even have a special AMC GME chat. If you scroll down, you can see some research and DD from the community. We also have funny memes, and you can see actual contributions from many members down here and again if you do join us it is a completely free link is down below but if you do want to become a patreon you will actually get a pink uh, sticker which will be displayed on your name so your name will come up in pink as mine comes up in red down here and that will show that you are a patreon but other than that guys you can join completely for free down below you do not have to pay anything if you do not want to thank you for watching see you soon